Hello folks, it's springtime here in Tennessee, here in the foothills of the Great Smoky Mountains of the, today, it's time to put out a little bit of this here uh, infamous Possum Ridge Paralyzer. I'm going to show you how old Johnny Reefer Seed does it here, see we in this going up field here, a few cows in it, but they're Bush hogs broke down, so I know they're not going to clean it up this year. So this year, blow down cedar trees is a good thing. It's camouflage because now the helicopters, they are bad here. They're a problem, you know, but you got to think about camouflage now. I brought me a bucket here, a little old rotten hand, some miracle girl, and I don't know, seeds, of course. Possum Ridge Paralyzer. <laughs> We've been around a long time in this country, fellas. And I'm going to clean this off a little bit. And dig her up. Let's use this bar here. They dig like... Well, I don't know what they dig like. They dig good. Good little start. Now when you just scatter your dirt all around, it's real obvious to spot from the air. So you need to think about hiding this stuff from the air. Uh, now it's not to even to mention the thieves on the ground. You got to hide it from the thieves on the ground. And the thieves in the air that come in with badges on their chest and steal your stuff. You gotta hide it from both of them. Anyway, what we're gonna do is dig this up a little bit. I wanna kinda hurry up here because it's looking rainy in the west, which is another thing. You got to remember that sunshine's important to grow you to grow your herb. Sunshine's as important as the fertilizer. Okay. Oh, this old rock hay. It feeds it, it holds moisture, and it's organic. Now you can get fish meal and blood meal, but the damn gone raccoons and the coyotes dig it up on you. So you're better off with a little rotten hay. And miracle grow. Dig it in there a little bit, mix it in that dirt. I can say we're hurry because it's going to rain quick. We got more to do. Dig it in there. About this stage of the game, you got to bring in the fence. And this is quarter inch square hardware cloth. I just cut it out and tied it in a circle, cut down the top four places, made it where I could open it up and shut it. Now if you don't do this, folks, the daggum field mice will eat all you see that, and you'll never see a plant come up. Okay. Y'all hurry, folks, it's going to rain in time. Let's see. A little bit of miracle grow at this stage. Give it something in its later days. To... Not much. Don't take much with this old rotten hay. This good stuff here, folks. Okay. Let's chop that in a little bit. Okay. 
Okay. Dump the rest of the dirt in there. Smooth it around a little bit. Hmm. A little bit cloudy, but that'll be all right. Enough rain will take care of her. It's got that hay right below it. Okay, now, there comes the good part. They're putting their seed in the ground. This makes 30 years I've been planting this particular seed. Around here we call it the Possum Ridge Paralyzer. And here we go, we're putting it in the ground today. Hey, wait a minute. Dad got it. Look what I did, folks. I brought the wrong dang gum seed jar. I brought tomatoes down here. I walked for an hour and a half. I'm briar scratched all over and I brought tomatoes down here. Dang gone. Well, what the heck? These might come in handy later on. You can't never tell. <laughs> Driving task force cars in hell, anybody want it? <laughs> and a little handful of this. It probably ain't done frosting here yet in these parts, so we give it a little frost protection. This helps too. Pull them over where the deer can't get in there and pick it. Pull this seat around it. Jerk a dead limb or two off. Camouflage it a little bit. And that's it, man. If that's it. You done almost seen the Possum Ridge Paralyzer put out. Y'all want to see more of the adventures of Johnny Reefer Seed? Go to this here website and order my book, The Johnny Reefer Seed Story. Y'all just might enjoy it.